You know I'm all about that exclusive sound. A DJ Red Alert is such a pioneer. He's a legend, and he's also humble about it when talking to him. The exhibit that we're talking about includes so many things, including some of his old turntables. Legendary DJ Red Alert on the ones and twos. Only real New Yorkers know the experience. He said everybody's the coolest legend, the cool, the DJ, the Red Alert. What you hear can now be seen in Port Authority. It's called the Red Alert Experience, an art exhibit that takes you on the disc jockey's journey through hip hop over 45 years. Everything here tells a story about the work DJ Red Alert put into hip hop, especially during a time when it was hard to get radio stations to play hip hop music. DJ Red Alert had his ears and fingers locked in to help launch so many careers by playing the music of new artists first. Bringing forth the Jungle Brothers which brings forth Q-Tip, which brings forth Queen Latifah, which bring, and then you got the Native Tongues. You know, you got Boogie Down Productions. The music kept Red Alert going for decades, and as old school hip hop meets new school, the DJ is not only keeping his fingers on turntables, but on the pulse of what's going on in hip hop today. He tells PIX11 News, the youth can learn something if they just take a look back. Read up on it, you know, just like you, you have history in school, got history right here. While he's excited about being honored this way, some of his fans feel like this is an honor for them as well. Crash One grew up listening to Red Alert and took time to present the DJ with one of his special pieces. And there's nothing more New York or hip hop than public transportation. Why Port Authority, a major transit hub, is the perfect place to host hip hop royalty. The exhibit includes photos, flyers from old music events, red alerts, turntables, and real memorabilia from over the years. And some exclusive images and artifacts from hip hop photographer Snapshot. I never knew it would get to this level. However, everything I shot, I kept in shoe boxes. Just, I keep things. And of course, this would not be a story told by a real New York journalist without having Red Alert leave his trademark with us. You gotta do it for us. I can't do it like Come I do on. it. Come We're on. talking over 30 some years ago. My voice is. <laughs> you gonna do it. You got to, Red Alert. Yes. Um, yes. <laughs> His voice is just fine. The exhibit will continue here at Port Authority till the end of March. It's in the south wing of the main concourse. And if you come through here, you can't be in a rush. You got to stop and really take it in.